and happening right now in Glastonbury. It's Connecticut uh, Food Share's annual turkey drive. That's where we find Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Dylan Fearon this morning. Good morning, Dylan. Hey, good morning, Christian. Yes, we're at First Church here in Glastonbury here with Bob. Things just kicked off. Bob, you staying warm? It's cold this morning. <laughs> we're trying. We, about that? we got the coffee going, which exactly, is good. Exactly, exactly. Things just kicked off. 8 to noon, hoping people come and drop off some turkeys. What, what are you looking for? That's right. Uh, well, last year, this, this official Connecticut Food Share drop location collected $10,000 and about 110 frozen turkeys. And so we want to beat those numbers this year. Let's talk about the need. I feel like we've been at some food drives in the last couple of weeks. People talking about uh, food insecurity has gone up uh, in the last year. Uh, what do you know about that? And, and, and yeah. Yeah, individuals, families, children across Connecticut worry about where their next meal is going to come from. Last year, Food Share uh, provided 37 and a half million meals from the contributions, many of them that come from Turkey and a 40. Where will these turkeys go? Uh, obviously, we're in Glastonbury. These go into Glastonbury families, but uh, families all across the state? All across the state, absolutely. Uh, there can be, you just never know where that need is going to be, and so food share's rather plugged in. This is actually an official location for a mobile Connecticut food share pantry that happens every uh, month at this location. And so um, we know that the food insecurity happens even near home. Fantastic. Well, Bob, thanks so much. Eight to noon here. First Church in Glastonbury. Come on down if you can help. And Christian, a, a really important event here today in Glastonbury. We'll send it back to you. Giving is just around the corner. There are people who desperately need help, though. Some don't know where their next meal is coming from. Connecticut Food Share is trying to change that. Here's Channel 3's Dylan Fearon in Glastonbury. These boxes are stuffed with turkeys. I mean, this year is tough for everybody. Thanks to generosity in Glastonbury. An extra turkey and $40. That's what Susan Lemke just dropped off. She's contributing to Connecticut Food Share's Turkey and 40 Drive, the food and money helping families who need it this Thanksgiving. Years ago, my husband and I used to farm together, and we always donated our leftover vegetables to Food Share. And I haven't done it in quite a few years since his passing. So I thought, why not? This is my year. Here's Norma dropping off a couple of turkeys at First Church in town. Volunteer Bob Inderbitson knows there are people worried about where their next meal will come from. An increase in people coming to food pantries across the state. Uh, some people live from uh, paycheck to paycheck or have lost that source of income and they need a meal immediately. Last year at First Church in Glastonbury, Connecticut Food Share collected more than $10,000 and more than 100 turkeys with this food drive, hoping to break those numbers today. There's always somebody else who has less, and so we're grateful to help families that, that need more. In Glastonbury, Dylan Fearon, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.